the extension sometimes looks very painful and in order to get the hand more flexible, the left hand, it's advisable to make thoughts about what you're really doing with, with the hand in stretching it. On the large vials there's actually only two positions, the normal position, so all fingers are more or less in the same distance, and the extension is like the first finger stretching away, and that's it. So to make this clear, put your hand just in a normal position and then try to exaggerate the movement by gliding back on the string all the way, all the way as far as possible. So even beyond the saddle, if possible, and back. And watch your arm more or less pushing the first finger back and forth. So it's the, the elbow pushing the finger in this direction. Do this movement very, very exaggerated. So afterwards, when you make it smaller, you have the feeling it's very easy. So this is one way of doing the stretching or the extension. The other one is like this. I personally don't like it that much, but you may do it like this, so, so stretch the finger like this. But as I said, for me, it's from the physiological way, it's not logical. So for me, this is much more flexible. And, and after a while, you get a really soft movement, gentle movement by doing this. And the extension upwards it's more or less the same thing. The idea is you move the whole hand a semitone upward and then you move half a, a semitone and then you do again the extension backwards. And that's it. So this is very logical and relaxes your brain. Because the only thing you do this or you do this and go there. Also, there's a second way of doing the extension upwards. It's like this feeling when you're holding the first finger and the whole arm is falling down. So again, uh, don't forget the thumb. So you can do this, you hold the, finger, the first finger here and you just imagine falling down all the way to the bridge but you're stopped by the first finger being fixed here. So that's the second way of, of practicing this movement. So one more time, stretching backwards, shift, stretching backwards, or having the first finger fixed and the whole hand falling down. <laughs> 